I put the thing on my chest a little bit right there. <clears throat> okay, try saying something. If I'm sitting here and what if you say something, what it would it sound like? Dicks. Sucks. Suck dick. <laughs> Twelve seconds later. Say hi. Say some kid. Hi, yeah. Let's go for it. Ooh. That's really cool. All right, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. All right. Oh, there's, they have like chemicals. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of shy. <laughs> I just I'm kind of shy. All right, no, I cut. <laughs> Sorry, might I interview you for a little bit? Yeah, sure. Yeah, so how how long did it take to make your costume? Uh, I'll put like two and a half months. But two and every a half months. But every time, like, it's just like, we just making new things and like that. Right. How much did it cost? you know how much it cost roughly? Uh, 100 ish? Under 100 if it's like proper. That's pretty good actually. Proper measurements and stuff. It's so, alright, I can ask you a few questions on here? Yeah, sure. Yeah, no problem. Sorry. Uh, how long does it take you to make this? Uh, there's a few weeks process in that because it started off as a life cast. We did a clay pour because there's a lot of flaws to fix in this face. Yeah, yeah. Uh, then it was molded with fiberglass and then produced in silicone. And the hair punch alone will take, like, it's a hyperdermic needle, so it's going to take a bit of time putting in those hairs one by one. Mm -hmm. Because I, I just noticed here, it's like a little bit, uh, you know, it's like oil. It's, all, uh, it's like almost like a yeah. little sweat. It, it's basically, it looks like it's precious ready. So silicone, when, when you're painting, sometimes it has a high shine. Yeah. Basically, you talc it or mat it down. And when you leave it in certain areas, it basically looks like it sweats. People be like, you sweat over there. Well, it's yeah, just, yeah, yeah. And again, it's how light hits and reflects off. Hold it next to the head, like, real quick. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. I'm six and a half years old, so. Just being younger looking, better looking. That's amazing. Actually. I don't yeah. want to like him now at this stage. <laughs> <laughs> right. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Enjoy the rest of the day. He's dead. Oh shit! <laughs> Wait, how was I already dead? <laughs> how do you jump? I don't know how people jump. Oh, you jump like that. Yeah. Okay. Give, me, give us your insight on this uh, amazing uh, uh, play. Give I'm not very used to playing on uh, those arcade uh, joysticks. I'm more of a controller player. Yeah. So, like, uh, Destroy it. What in mashing right now, is the key. One mashing. <laughs> it's probably the metal you. right now. The red balls go in the red section. Blue balls go in the Oh, we need to put them in the correct. Yes, you can go to any other. That's what she said. You guys have no skills. Come on, do better. Try harder. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, man, be eating good. <laughs> Isn't that like just messing with me? It gets lit. <laughs> 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 Sorry, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah.
Um, we, me and a couple of my friends have a blast. Um, the main reason I was there was to meet my, one of my favorite voice actors, John DiMaggio, who voices Jake the dog, and have him sign my lovely Funko Pop. Here's a picture of it right here. Also on a side note, I also sort of wanted to show him my Jake the dog socks as well. Here's a picture of that. Um, we couldn't get any footage of John because his manager said that uh, there's no be no filming allowed. But I did get a quick little voice recording of this very wholesome interaction. Enjoy. Hey John, I was just starstruck, but I forgot to show you this. No shit. That's it. I. Hell yeah. I got Finn B mode and everyone. So. Yeah. You got that drip, homie. That's it. I'm telling you, you got right. the drip. Yeah. Thanks so much. Thanks, man. Have a good one. Yeah. Amazing. Yep. You did.